Hello YouTube and welcome back to Ground Forex Plays Abandoned Ship. Well, as you are seeing this video, this game has just launched into early access and uh, we will be taking a look at the story. I was granted an early build by the devs, so thank you very much for that. And let's create a new game. Today I will be showing the story and we'll start with the very basics of course, with the tutorials on a normal difficulty because, well... And also by signing up to the Bannership newsletter, you can have your name added to the game. So if you tick the, this box, you will have your name spawned in the game. And guys, if you buy the game and you and I end up on your, uh, on your list, please do let me know in the comments below. That would be kind of fun. And we'll put, I'm gonna put a... Ground Forks plays abandoned ship as a random seed. A wild chorus, the birth of a monster. In that moment, the final strand is cut. A burst of clarity, the horror with recent experience. The tentacle will flail in the water. People drop to their knees, some through fear, others through adulation. The god is manifest. You watch from your position of privilege on a private balcony, and you notice two bodyguards misbehave. West, in this cantling grabbing something, you smash it down on the hand of the first guard. You feel a drip from your fingers, you look at an improvised weapon, small, and it's cracked, cut your hand, let's get out of here. You stride into a prison with foreign authority, no matter the place is unguarded, so let's, who will we unlock first? So we have to unlock some people. Severed one, I guess that would be me. And let's see, the navigator gains bonus to performing ship maneuvers, gunners an expert at reloading weapons, marine, melee, fighter, surgeon, and a sailor. I'm gonna go with the gunner, because reloading weapons means faster damage, surgeon means higher uptime on my crew, and sailor means we can keep our ship afloat, hopefully. So I'm gonna stick with these three, let's continue. You and your companion search through the labyrinth passage, blah blah. You close your eyes for a moment as he brushes your face. And yeah. Okay, so this is the tutorial a little bit. And I think it's good that I kind of show you how it gives you the hand-holding experience to start with. I've already played a little bit through this, so this is basically guiding you how you control, what are your controls, and how do you, you know, play the Abandoned Ship game. I've played it a little bit uh, on the demo which I've shown you, and uh, I'm gonna play through the story now. So this is something that I will be showcasing. I'm hoping to have a multiple episodes, but let's just take it from here and see where it goes. And there we go, we're controlling the ship. I'm gonna be skipping through some of the text because, yeah, I mean, you can pause the screen and read them on your own if you want to. But, uh, yeah, They'll, and the bottom line is we ran away and stole a ship, so cultists will be, I guess, sending some ships and firing upon us, so... So this is basically teaching you, I mean, the mechanics. So if you can see a crew member back down to zero health, you have to stabilize him very quickly. Otherwise, he might be gone for good. And also, the barrage has uh, damaged the ship's hull, and that's this bottom bar. You have to be really careful in terms of, you know, doing it right. Also, you can repair ship components. And that will hopefully, you can see the bottom right icon of your ship. That's the status of various stations. So I'm just moving my crew around to repair all the stations. And note that the sailor, who is actually down, would actually be the fastest one at repairing things. You have to remember that each crew is good at their specialization. So use that to full advantage. Not yet over, take cover. Oops. Oh, and we have some hull cracks. So when you see that, you will hear the ship bell. You need to quickly rush and fix that because the water is leaking. And the water meter can be seen on the bottom left, just above your ship's hull. 
and you will be seeing it and you need to pump out the water as you move the guys to pump out water you will see the water gauge there you go nearly out of range one more barrage incoming oh fires so let's move people to fix the fires so this is basically teaching you how to deal with various types of damage to your ship due to the enemy action so leave combat oh and this is the map mode this is a, an exploration in the last version i actually played it there was no this mode so we are leaving from the cult fortress and we need to find the gate to escape other doors are closed this is map of the immediate area we need to go to the gate that's highlighted at the bottom okay return to the exploration map so navigate over to the gate at the bottom of the map use the button to view the whole map if you need to remember where it is okay sure Ooh, something to pick up wait wait wait, wait. 20 yes I don't know if it's 20 gold or 20 coin, but still, let's use it. Locked gate can be opened by... Comp uh, and in this case, by opening the events. In this case, it's a battle event. Remember the lessons you have learned so far. Will do. So, you Sunshine, you're going to the... Cannons. And a uh, surgeon, you can go actually and mend the swivel guns, please. Weapon reloading. Yeah, so when you mend the cannons, they start to reload. And you have to select the target for them. Oh, we have a hull crack. So let's just select the target quickly. And you select the target by right clicking. Surgeon, you go and repair this while you sunshine the fire. Okay, space is paused. I actually don't do paused very well. I don't know, it's the same thing with Bomber Crew. I don't, or Bomber Crew, I don't uh, really play paused too much. I find it to be a little bit more interesting. Yeah, during the pause, basically, you can do stuff, issue orders, etc. Okay, let's mend the, sw mend the swivel guns. Chain shot, it's basically... Yeah, so the enemy is moving away from us, and if you want to close the distance, we have to disable their sails, because then they will be less maneuverable than us, and that way is the way how we can actually attack them. So, swivel guns full, let's aim for the sails. Fire. Okay, we have halved their sails. While still firing on them, as you can see this brings us a little bit closer. And now they bring people to repair stuff so they get a little bit further away. This is I guess still for combat tutorial, so fire. We have killed our sails, so time to move to the... Oh, and this is, I guess, the Grape Shot. The Grape Shot is actually very... At the close distance, Grape Shot is anti-personnel weapon. Man it and get it fully loaded. So anti-personnel means it does a lot of damage to the, uh, to the crew. And fire. Ooh, quite a lot of damage. And we have the maneuver bar that we could actually ram the enemy or flee and whatnot. So, great shot again, come on. That, we really did a number on their navigator. So now let's ram them and brace for impact. Kaboom! 
So since the enemy didn't brace for impact, they are actually have a member overboard. We can we could choose to board them, but we really don't want to. I pre I'm more of a cannons guy. If you know, if you have seen any of my naval action videos, you have noticed that I prefer to shoot from long range rather than boarding action. But when he comes, fire! And that's one crew member dead. So they're now one member short, which is perfect. Come on, one more broadside and they're done. Kaboom. Sayonara, suckers. Well, it's a tutorial, so no, not much good gloating over it. Still satisfying, though. Grab what you can be quick about it. Yes. Aha, uh -huh. and as you can see, I never read that because I always continue repairing my sections and my crew. Good to know. I'm actually, by the way, recording the audio in post-commentary. I will probably do it more live when I will be playing it, but this is still kind of useful. So, examine yourself in the mirror. I'm not sure if I would like what I see. Whew. I'm the severed one. No, I'm Grumpworks. Skin tone a little less crispy. Just so it matches my physical beauty. Yeah, that's... Uh... Okay, let's see. We re-emerge onto the deck, crew snap to attention. We may have escaped, but we are not yet safe. Okay, still love till in his thoughts, you were the first. But he knew something within it has changed. Though you're marginalized, etc, etc. So, the cult fortress is far from inhabited lands, let's just... Oh, and review your ship. Okay, let's do that. This is new. I haven't been doing this lone ship view. Ah, uh, default settings where that would be used in combat. Preferred distance. Cool. Crew stations. Yes. So let's see how will we arrange them. I would actually prefer to have a gunner on the swivel gun so it reloads fast and these other two guys on the cannons to put a constant damage pressure onto the enemy crew. Okay, if you need the crew back to the save location you can press the highlighted button. Guys, devs, if you're watching this, is there a key bind assigned to that same button? Because I would love to have it. Return to the exploration map. Sure. By fleeing from this exploration map. Okay. We are in the danger so close to the cult fortress. Yeah, 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 sure. Escape the area and then we can search for a port. Okay. Let's check out what do they have. I get the sense of urgency, but... Let's see what is this all about. Uncover the area here. See what's up, what gives. The map looks kind of cool. I assume it's uh, procedurally generated. Because we did have random seed at the beginning, so I'm guessing they used, the devs used it to populate this map. So, and there's the gate. Let's just go a little bit around. Okay, and when we come to the gate, ooh, zero out of four. Aha. Uh -huh. 
So I guess we have four tasks, quests, things to complete on this map before we are allowed a passage. And I'm guessing this is one of them. I sure don't like the icon because the icon looks like either the cult uh, it looks like the cultists. Oh well, might as well. Clash on with the vessel flying cult colors. Well, you know what? Let's give them a bashing. You will be aiming here and you shall be aiming there. And you shall fire. They returned a favor, obviously. A little bit tense music, I like it. But still, you know, silent enough and subtle. Good choice. Getting ready. Come closer. I would have loved to have another crew member, but I guess as long as we keep the pressure up, I think we're good. Down the sails go. And they have a sailor repairing them, meaning it will take actually quite fast. And our sails are actually kind of dumb, but I haven't realized that. I have no idea what this means when it's flashing. Oh, it means the station is broken. Well, I'm not using those cannons anyway, so... Bottom line, he has one cannon battery facing us, uh, we have two. So we should be better off. But they're really all about fixing their sails. Well, it doesn't matter as long as I'm giving them a solid thrashing. Okay, sailor. No, not you, Doc. Well, okay, Doc, please repair this. You, fire. Okay, so far, easy going. But I guess I could really use more people on the repairs. Hmm. Come on. Fire. We are still making damage. Oh, and they busted our sails. Bastards. They're trying to pull exactly what I'm trying to pull. I'm just thinking maybe it would be faster if I reassign the sailor here for the fixes. And then hit them in the Kanigis. There we go. But you be manning the cannons, and that's a dock, if I'm not mistaken. Fire at their sails. We are closing the gap by a little, so that's good. But we are still almost... oh, come on. Get up closer, you miserable little... Yeah. Roland and Doe. Nice work, Roland. Thank you very much. Oh! Fire! Now, Doc, mend the swivel guns, please. Let's see if we can thin their numbers a little bit. You get ready on the chain shot there. 
I want to keep them close enough. Grape shot. Bye bye. Come on, chain shot. Their sailor is really determined. Let's see if we can kill off their captain. Because that would make some problems. Let's take these two down. Sails, once again, they're repairing them. But how can they fire if they're not... Hmm, that, that's strange. Yeah, they're still firing with the full battery, though. Okay, Captain is now on exchange, that's good. That means nobody should be repairing the sails. Oh, the gunner is repairing the sails. You know what, at this point, let's just sink him. I was hoping to do a more dramatic capture, but... I think another broadside and they're goners. Well, another broadside, perhaps. Arthas, go repair our guns and let's finish them off, shall we? Grape shot? Come on. There you go. Whack down that sailor. And there they go. A uh, bye bye. Say hello to Mr. Davy Jones for me, will ya? Victory. Number of crates with the giant J. Well, whatever that means. And guys, I do apologize because I will be repairing every single time in this first episode because I'm now just remembering that this ship will you know fix itself automatically so once again note to you guys if you're playing this awesome game I do recommend that you don't do that because you would be just wasting your time as I'm now wasting mine well yeah fortunately it doesn't take very long so There we go. I think we're done. Move screws to your last safe positions. Perfect. Let's leave the combat, shall we? So that's one out of four. Oh, we have three more to go. And our health bar doesn't look too healthy now, does it? Let's search for more trouble, shall we? Oh, the islands of one out of four. Oh, and there's another one. Perfect. Attack, of course. I mean, is that even a question? Closing in on the subject. We do have, they have a boarding specialist, sailor, and a captain. And one cannon battery. I would say we can do them. Let's take care of the sails first. And the sailor gets to repair, of course. Pretty much expected. This chain shot is nice, but I'm missing another harassment gun or something, so... Chain shot, fire. 
Yeah, sailor, you go repair the mast because they are also targeting my mast. At this point I'm thinking forget about the grape shot and let's just give them some lovin. And fire. Okay, we're repaired now, you man this little guns. So far they're holding out, but uh, I mean, we outgunned them, I think. I guess we stole a good ship. Alright, so getting another chain shot in. That helps us keep the distance lower and now I have moved our surgeon to the grape shot to operate on the enemy. Oh, they're firing four cannons well but must be slower caliber or something because they're not doing that much of a damage. This should zero them in and fire. Okay, another chain shot coming in, but I think the next broadside and they're goners. Yeah, I guess this early in the game, maybe, I uh, know, doing the chain shot and fence stuff isn't that much of a thing. It's more of a keep a constant rain on, of uh, DPS on the enemy, I guess. And now I take everybody to do the repairs. Down it goes. Victory, perfect. So once again I'm repairing everything. Okay, two down, two more to go. I mean, if we continue at this pace, uh, we'll be good. Now let's see what wonderful surprises this map has in store for us. And, oh! We lost the ship in pursuit. Drop to your knees like a lightning storm in style massive ancient intelligence coming. What is that? You can't terrorize your eyes. Whatever it is, it will be in you. The Kraken. What? You're not prepared to fight such a beast? Fight it off and flee. We should press the flee maneuver. Okay. Yeah, gladly. I don't like the looks of that. Okay, how do I fight it? Uh, mommy! Oh, trapped. Okay, well, I thought it was gonna be way worse. Okay, let's do this. So we need to cut the tentacles. I guess Johnny Depp style. Now, flee before the attacks begin. Okay, so I guess the, its attacks will be grappling the ship and I have to make sure that uh, we fill the flea meter before we get destroyed, I guess. Okay. Ow. Sever the tentacles that bind the ship, yes. Get out. Now flee before it attacks again. Okay, Captain is manning the wheel, so the maneuver should be charged sooner rather than later. Come on, come on, come on. 
press it, press it. Oh, bugger. Ow. Please do not destroy my ship. Okay, now we should consider about the flea button. There we go. Maneuver bar not charged. Well, now it's charging. Okay, I think we'll have to endure one more attack or two. I think one more should be fine. Dang it. Come on, cut, cut, cut. Okay, now you quickly do that on the flea bar and let's get the hell out of here. Oh shoot, it's coming again. Come on, fill up, fill up, fill up, fill up. Yes! We're out of there! You wounded the creature and escaped. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We should not dally. I fully agree. However, we have one more event. There are three out of four, so the gate is still locked, as you can see on the icon in the bottom right corner. So we should find one more event. Hopefully. Where are you? Okay, we have a big chunk of the map unexplored in just below the gate. I have a feeling that's where we will meet our fate. Close to the gate. Alright, so let's take a look here. Oh! There it is. Uh oh. Well, we are not in the best shape. Everybody focus. Now, I think with this guy we have to maximize our DPS. No horsing around, so. We will be aiming for the crew. Straight for our sails. I mean, I will shoot at his sails, but still. Fire. Hmm. We are coming closer. Getting ready for another chain shot. You know, forget about it. Let's just do the raw DPS here. They do have cannons, so, and they're hitting us with cannons. Just raw DPS. Ding, ding, ding. We are in the red. This one is going to be a tight one. They are also fully manned and uh, although it's a smaller ship, I'm in a worse ship, I'm in a worse state than they are. So I aim to just outgun them. I don't care about the state of their crew because if I horse around I'm gonna be dead. Level up. That's nice. I think our gunner leveled up. Does that mean he will be able to reload the guns even faster? Oh, that would be just grand. I think we got this, guys. They are running away. However, one more broadside and... Yes! Goodbye, suckers! And 
once again I put everybody to repair duty because well yeah okay sales and I'm definitely not gonna repeat this stuff in the next episode that's for sure so okay move here repair this please great we can you can go back to your seats and let's leave the combat time to go through the gate and as you can see by the icon the gate is open the icon I mean icon in the bottom right corner of the map so let's go to the third map the danger has passed the creature cult worship it yeah 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 let's focus on reaching the port quickly I agree with this much health I mean there's no point of contemplating the being the existence and uh, the the answer to the space universe and everything so so find a port where we can be safe I'm already feel safe when I collect 20 gold thank you very much The crew morale seems to be high, 50. Okay, we have to find the gate and we also need to explore, but we should find the nearest port first, as our um, map tells us. And there it is. Well, let's not dilly-dally crew is reluctant to part ways oh they like me oh that's so nice let's go and have a drink and sing kumbaya shall we you manage your headaches more than it should well that's what happens when you drink heavy meat is a different story to the ceremonial while shall we call it a night yes we shall tentacles grasping every angle no escape blah blah and uh, you jolt away I mean you guys can read this for yourselves I just want to show you you know to arms oh okay to corpse al halifron okay so somebody was you know attacking us apparently So I guess our mission would be to kill the Kraken. You mean that big thing that I was just get, trying to get uh, uh, out of its reach? Yeah, that's kudos. That's prudent plan. Yeah, good idea. We can do it for sure. Just uh, we and uh, what army? Yeah, it's just you now. Of course, it's just me. I mean, I proposed to the, my crew that I should be, we should be killing the crap can with what? Pitchforks? Okay, weapon and repairs. Now we're talking. So what do we have? Repair everything and... Yeah. Oh, hull repaired for free. Thank you. Purchasing weapons buy a mortar don't mind if I do sell weapons and upgrades come on I'm not that crazy increasing cannons yes we can do that for sure I think that's increasing our base DPS and others will be kind of fun upgrade purchase new sh supplies hull armor harpoons hull spikes and a lifeboat well let's sell some supplies shall we okay some sections to a higher level we could upgrade some sections to a higher level yeah uh, we can upgrade the masts later I would say 
for the time being, let's check out the ships. Cutter, seems small. Schooner, equally small. Brig, I think that's what we have right now. Sloop, three masts, frigate, warship, and then the man of war. Oh, those will be fun. Cannon batteries for, yeah, sure. Can we upgrade these? I'd like to upgrade something. Although hull armor doesn't sound too shabby. Harpoons. Hull spikes. That's basically when we ram. Lifeboat. Ramming is not my style. My style is the, you know, constant barrage. So I'm gonna go with a hull armor. Thank you. We have increased our cannon count and we have increased our hull armor. I think we're good, actually. Weapons repairs. I could buy another cannon, though. This guy. Regular round shot. There we go. I think we're good. Right. Upgrade supplies. I think I don't have any more cash for anything. So might as well, you know, call it a day and return to port. Okay, we make our way to the end. We're just a few cultists, blah, blah. And the, the crew comes back and they tell me that they like me still. And that they would like to avoid cultists putting the knife in the small of their back. So let's go to the tavern and get some more crew. Because the, apparently the rest of the crew had some cash with them. Now, I'm just thinking, to keep it simple, I would take another gunner. Because two gunners, fast reload times, everything else comes second. So, sounds good. Ground forks are to seem Pavido, Roland Endo, and Zeke. Return to port. Time to leave. Escape. Cultists have invaded this area. Escape and before they capture you. They would capture me. Shot and steal, lads. Oh, another fight. But now let's... It's actually a perfect testing ground for our upgraded ship. And our additional guy, you should go man the cannons. You should go actually man... No, you should... Yeah. Okay. You should go man the... This guy. Let's fire at them. Oh, and they have a squid, apparently. Okay, fire. Let's just give them a solid thrashing. And I cannot shoot them by grape shot. Oh boy. Halifron! Aquatic monsters that appear on cult vessels, dive in the water. Okay, so we're being boarded by that thing. Let's get ready for a fight. Come on, fight him. I mean, three versus one should be a rather straightforward fight. There we go, it's done. Oh, and I forgot that I have this wonderful weapon. Oh, which is called mortar. So, you man this, you man this, and you man this, and somebody, can somebody please man the mortar? Now, apparently, the old me, which was recording, 
needed uh, to be a little less of a dumbass and realize that uh, I have a mortar, which is perfect for long range shots. Instead I was trying to close the gap. Oh, silly me. But we didn't bust their um, sails plane open, so I think we're gonna do fine now. Our increased number of cannons is staring them definitely a new one, so... Fire. Oh, and let's move the cannoneer to... Oh, they were firing the grape shot. They would like to board us. Oh, that's good. Oh, come on. Yeah, yeah you, you just keep us at, at close range because I have another grape shot. There you go. And another mortar. Catch. Kaboom. Oh, those are refilling quite fast. Wonderful. I'm already beginning to like this. Fire. And... Fire. And there we go. Perfect. So guys, I mean, I'm gonna wrap it up at this point. Do like if you like this uh, abandoned ship. Also subscribe for more actions and... Uh, do connect with me on social media, you'll have the links below. And guys, definitely do check out the Abandoned Ship full game. I will link it in the description on... It's available on Steam now, so I will link the um, the page where... The Steam page where the game is below in the description. So do give it a look. I think it's very fun and I'm enjoying playing it. So that will be it from me. So once again... Thank you very much for watching, this is Gromforks, signing off.